Well, hey folks, welcome back, and we'll start down by the grill again today. We got the Weber Charcoal Go Anywhere Grill. Uh, if you want to see the mods, I obviously I added these handles. I did add a uh, temp gauge to it, Tom Horseman at YouTube, and you can see a whole video on how I did that. What we're going to do today is we're going to do indirect ribeyes, two ribeyes. And uh, you can see we got, you're wondering what, what that is. I got set up there. I have used this before, and I'll, I'll make sure to, uh, there's another video that has a link with it, but I'll find the link, put it, but it's just a, somebody made this. It's an aluminum piece. It's not that thick, but I've covered it in aluminum foil, and what it does is it acts as a diffuser plate for once you get your charcoal in there. So we're going to pile up our charcoal and get her going here on the Weber Go Anywhere, and uh, we'll give you a look-see once we get going. You stay tuned. All right, there's our, there's our ribeyes, two nice looking ribeyes. I did trim up some of the outer fat on it. Obviously, you want to keep some fat on there. That's good. Uh, and uh, I've got some oil on there. I've talked about this before. I love this saying, stir fry oil. If you can find it, it is infused with garlic, onion, and herbs. And that's what makes it so great. And it's for high heat. So it uh, works really nice. And then, uh, yeah, stay, stay with Weber here. Weber steak and chop. I like this stuff a lot. So get these on the grill indirect. Uh, we're going to make them rare. We're going to take them up to maybe 105, 105, 110-ish, pull them off, then pull the indirect plate off, let everything get nice and hot, put our grill grates on there, and get a nice sear. Stay tuned, and we'll show you all that. All right, folks, let's take a quick look of our indirect. You see I've got bottom vents wide open, top vents wide open. Temp right now uh, is just coming up for right around just about 100 degrees. Uh, you can see we've got some nice smoke. That's what I'm looking for. There's our setup. There they are indirect on the Weber Go Anywhere. So cover this back up. Like I said, I'm going to take this up to about 105. And then we're going to pull them, wrap them, and then we'll pull the indirect off, put the grill grates on there, let it get smoking hot, and give them a nice sear. You stay tuned for that. All right, folks, we got the grill grates going with the, uh, the rib eyes on there looking mighty nice. Let's give a quick flip here and see how they're doing. Oh, yeah, look at that. That is, uh, let's see how the other one's going here. That is ribeye perfection right there, folks. I don't care what you say. You can go ahead and criticize all you want, but that's that's looking mighty nice right there. So get these plated up and give you a look. See, stay tuned. All right, folks. There's a ribeye. Got some. Oh, we got some mushrooms that the wife made. Delicious. And let's just go into this ribeye here and take a quick look, shall we? Look at that, nice and medium rare. Beautiful. We'll take just a little chunk out of here. That's perfect, folks. Uh, this really, I don't know where we're going anywhere. Charcoal grill, perfect steak, uh, perfect ribeye. Folks, uh, Tom Horseman at YouTube, leave a comment. I got a ton of other videos. Feel free, take a watch. And as always, can't say it enough. Thanks for watching. I really do appreciate it.